What is good, Saints fans? Ross Jackson here at Ross Jackson Nola on Twitter. And as always, thank you very much for joining us here at Canal Street Chronicles. It's a pleasure to come to you today, being able to talk a little bit about a very special football player in Patrick Queen, the LSU linebacker. Just a fantastic player. And you have seen me before mock Kenneth Murray to the New Orleans Saints, but with the way that the board fell here, and it just made perfect sense to go with Patrick Queen here. So Patrick Queen to the Saints with the 24th overall selection in this one. Now, what do you get with a guy like Patrick Queen? Well, when it comes to Patrick Queen versus Kenneth Murray, you clearly get a better player in terms of coverage. You might miss out a little bit on the pass rush, but he has shown to be a factor in that as well, and he's been a factor in the run game. 85 tackles in 2019 with the Tigers, 12 of those for a loss, as well as three sacks, but he also added three passes, defense, and an interception. So you see that he's all across that stat sheet, and that's exactly what you would get out of him in the NFL. He might be a little bit less of a factor in the pass rush because of his size, six foot, 229 pounds, but we have seen those guys, and exactly those linebackers actually, come out of LSU undersized, like Deion Jones, like Devin White, like Quan Alexander, and do just fine in the NFL. So when you look at what you're gonna get with this guy, you get the same sideline to sideline speed that you would get when it comes to Kenneth Murray, but you add that coverage ability, you get a guy that's from just outside of Baton Rouge, just an hour long drive away from New Orleans. And Jeff Ireland has said over and over again that he's always looking for guys that are going to be good in Sean Payton's system and Dennis Allen's system, Dennis Allen's system over on defense. But you're always looking for guys that are going to fit in the locker room and they're going to be those culture guys. And with Patrick Queen coming over from LSU, that is a team that is all about culture. One team, one heartbeat. Ed Ogeron, big time emotional leader over there. You get to bring a hometown guy, essentially a home state guy, if you will. You get to bring that type of culture. You get to bring that type of leadership to the Saints locker room, and he's going to fit in right away with guys like Demario Davis, uh, Cam Jordan, Marshawn Lattimore, all those guys over on defense, and of course, he's going to fit in in his locker room, or rather his position group, just fine. So with that being the case, he's someone that can come in and become a three-down linebacker for you. He could start as a three-down linebacker day one, more than likely, but it may be that you don't see that happen right away just because you're giving him some time to acclimate to the NFL, but it wouldn't surprise me if he jumps into that starting three-down role as soon as he possibly can, which could mean at the very beginning of the season, depending upon how the injuries of Alex Anzalone and Kiko Alonso are coming along at once the season actually gets started. So Patrick Queen to the New Orleans Saints here at at pick number 24, you keep the home state guy in Louisiana and you start off your draft strong, selecting a defender at the second level that's going to help to improve your already very promising Saints defense.